close your eyes and focus on your breath. Take a couple of good long, deep in and out breaths. Breathe in a way that feels refreshing. If long breathing feels refreshing, keep it up. If it doesn't, you can change. Make it shorter, faster, slower, heavier, lighter, whatever feels most refreshing right now. This is something you can tap into at any time. This is one of the big ironies of life is a lot of the best things in life are right next to you and they're free. And yet we go running off for things that are far away and cost a lot of money and take a lot of effort and sometimes involve us some bad karma. But this pleasure right here is blameless, and it can be with you at any time. And it's free. You think about all the money that's been spent in the past couple of days buying things, sending things, sending things back. For what purpose? It's hard to tell. I mean, people want to show their goodwill for one another. Well, they can do good for one another lots of different ways. As for the good you do to yourself, you have to look after yourself. Because there are a lot of things, areas in life that no one else can look after for you. Like the state of your mind, the ability to sit here and be at ease with yourself. It sounds like something very simple, but all too often we get involved in other things that make it hard for us to do that. So try, try to clear some space in your life, both in the sense of the time that you give to the meditation, and look at the things that you do that you don't feel quite right about, and ask yourself, well, what can I change? We're facing a new year. It's a good time to think about what you'd like to change in life, because this is one of the essences of the Buddhist teachings on action, which you can change your actions. You don't have to be the way you are. You don't have to keep on acting the way you are. If you see that it's something that you're doing that's not giving good results, you can change. <laughs> And the meditation gives you the strength to see that and to do that. So try to give the mind a place where it can settle down and be at ease with itself. And if you notice there's anything that comes up that you're not at ease about, okay, ask yourself, what can I change in the way I live my life? Any precepts that I should take on? Any ways that I should be more generous with my time, with my knowledge, with my forgiveness for other people? These are good things to think about. And then meditation gives you a good solid place to stand or, or to sit and look at these things and make good choices. And you have to wait for the new year. You can do it at any time. When you see if there's something you've done that's unskillful, you can change. And you can develop things that give this greater sense of ease. As I said, it's free. The old phrase is, the best things in life are free. And this is one of the best things there is, of a mind that can live with itself not create a lot of problems for itself. So look into it. We've come, we've been generous, we take the precepts, but there's always more work to be done with the meditation. So make sure you give it the time and the energy that it deserves. <laughs>